Good morning. Hey, Tablo. <laughs> Sleepy puppy. Good morning. It's about 6.30 in the morning. <sighs> Preparing to move. Oh, our landlord doesn't like this cute face. But it's okay, because our new apartment is much bigger. So we're actually happy that we have to move. Today we are moving, as Ashley said, and our apartment is a crazy mess right now. We're waiting for the movers to come by, and they're going to help us by basically packing up everything and moving it over to the next place. I mean, we got this big fridge right here. This is like double the size of a regular Korean fridge. Um, lots of clutter everywhere. It's only because we have a small apartment. So, yeah, it's going to be a really big job and we're really happy for these Korean workers. Thank you, Korean workers. The movers were supposed to come at 8 o'clock, but it is now 7.30. Fortunately, Juseo, which is the service we use to find the movers, warned us that uh, it's typical of Korean movers to arrive early. We weren't really expecting 30 minutes early, but fortunately we woke up at 6, so that's good. The movers have come in here and they're like a storm. They're really going to town on the apartments, which is really helpful. There's three, three of them. I am discovering it's all but impossible to vlog while walking with two dogs. Each and every single time, I think this is my fifth attempt, each and every single time a dog will stop to uh, go to the bathroom so I have to clean that up. And it happens right as I turn on the camera, so that's fun. Our dog's first time seeing our new apartment, kitchen, living room. This is called a veranda where we can hang up laundry. Other veranda where we can hang up more laundry and put our fridge. This will be our bedroom. And here's the bathroom. Maybe people back home will find this interesting. We uh, don't actually have a shower, we just shower in the bathroom and then the water drains under the sink. I think this will just be an extra storage room or as Grand likes to call it, the Gahanzen room. But we'll see about that. Time to feed the dogs and then go back to the old apartment. Don't worry guys, I'll be back. I feel a little bit useless right now in terms of the move. The workers are going to town on our apartment. Um, Ashley just took the dogs to our new place, get them out of the way. So I think I'll do more harm if I'm in there. I'll be more in the way. So I'm hanging out in the hallway. This is the truck that will take our fridge from the window to the truck, I think. I think this is it. Maybe I'm wrong, but I think I'm right. What do you think, Ashley? Probably right. Cool. This is a phenomenon that is only in Korea, I think. I haven't seen this back home in Canada. Well, but what, what about New York? Uh, All skyscrapers? In New York, I think they have with the clothes, they take them from the window, like a third story, fourth story window, and um, move it down to the truck. But this is like a big fridge and moving stuff, like just stuff. We don't know, but this is pretty common in Korea. If they have really big stuff and no elevator like we don't have at the moment, then they'll use this uh, lift thing to get everything down. Yeah, it's pretty revolutionary. I wish they did that back home. Pretty smart. Yep. <laughs> That just happened. It's 
smoking guy is a badass. Our massive fridge is supposed to go in that thing. I'm a little scared. I'm heading to the new apartment right now with... So this day is turning out to be a lot more stressful than we initially planned. The dogs at the new apartment, we were barking up a storm and so we took them to the vet. Moving into one of these nondescript apartment buildings in Korea. Living the Korean dream. I've always hated moving, but moving is infinitely worse with pets, especially when you have two dogs and one cat. Awful. All right, and here is our house with everything in it. We still need to unpack a lot of things, but I'm really impressed with these movers. Look at this. They organized our spices and our tea. And they kind of made our bed. And they put our stuff in all the right rooms. So, um, Korean movers. Very good. I just heard what happened in Paris about the bombs and the shootings and uh, terrorist attacks. Uh, my heart goes out to the people of Paris. Um, don't know exactly what happened, but I don't think anybody does. So news is still rolling in, but happened on day I'm vlogging, so I thought I would mention something about that. And there they go. Very, very hard workers. Very happy. Can't use that. at all. Uh, uh, there's so much space. Uh, this apartment is magical. Uh, there's no one below us. Yeah, night jumping. As my uh, first graders explained it to me. You know what we can do? We can play the game. The yeah, not have to worry game. about. We are on the first floor so we can jump as much as we want. We have so much space in our new apartment. New apartment, so much space. I'm going around in circles. Ashley doesn't know what is happening. I'm getting very dizzy. mission to go find out if this apartment building has a roof. I want to see if I can do a time lapse up there because sunset will be in 15 minutes, but it's cloudy so probably be no sunset. Look at this. Like I said, this roof is awesome. I'm gonna get so many great time lapses here. Hopefully when the sun's out. So right now it's kind of cloudy, so not very good for that. Today was crazy stressful, but I'm glad uh, we're all done with everything, and I think we're both happy with the new place, right? Yeah, We're all definitely. five of us are happy with the new place. So. Yeah, it's much bigger, much better, and so yeah, very proud. Um, proud? Yeah, proud. <laughs> very, day, I mean, good. Very proud. Um, <laughs> if you like this video, please subscribe and comment below, I think. Um, yeah. Vlog number 18 is over. Goodbye. <laughs>